All right, guys, here we go. Another hizzy, you know, short for how it should have ended. Another another one of these that I'm reacting to. And it's uh, it's one of their latest ones, which being how Star Wars Obi-Wan Kenobi should have ended. Yep. So I'm looking forward to this one. So without further ado, yeah, volume's good. All right, let's begin. What are they going to do with this? You never know what they're going to do with, you know, these movies and so on. We're tracking an escape craft. There's one life on board. That's you. My lord, we must continue our pursuit of the insurgents. We cannot prioritize one lone Jedi. I know that. Do you think I'm stupid? We have more than one ship, you know. Ready my shuttle. I will face him alone. You stay of course, my lord. The Navy launched some TIE fighters instead of standing around just staring out the window. Okay, we will. Jeez. Well, so much for that idea. <laughs> There's that line. Nice. No, it's not. Oh, Anakin, I'm, I'm so sorry. No, I'm not. That's kind of exactly what I meant to do. I hate you so much. Oh, come on, Anakin. I did you a favor, really. This place is so dark. It's a wonder you can see anything in that hell. How are you not burned? What are you talking about? I dragged you through fire, and it did nothing. Oh, that. Yeah. That's true. I don't know. No worries. No stars. No sushi. Yeah. I dipped my shovel of a leg in lava one time, and I burst into flames. He did. What is happening to me? I pulled the wrong ship out of the sky. I buried you in a pit of boulders. That didn't even work. I even stabbed Regal with my lightsaber. And I'm pretty sure she didn't even die. Whoa, whoa, whoa. <laughs> oh, wait, just a minute. Hold on. Surviving lightsaber stabbings. You can do that, Mar. You can do that, Jal. Master Qui-Gon, where have you been? Oh, I've always been here. You just weren't ready. But... I, I called out to you several times. Wait, you've always been here. Oh, yes, I'm afraid I've seen a lot of things. I yep. use the bathroom excessively, my old Padawan. Gross. Me. I'm supposed to be the most powerful Jedi ever. At the very least, my lightsaber should finish off some rookie Inquisitor. Perhaps she used the Force to heal herself. Force healing. <laughs> There's no way that can also be a thing. I'm telling you, it could happen. Well, why didn't anyone try that on me when I got skewered? Yes, yes. Well? Yes. I think this hole in my helmet is making it hard to breathe. Nobody will. Well, perhaps you should use the force to heal your lungs. Don't make me destroy you. Well, if you can't kill with a lightsaber, how are you going to kill a force? It just sounds like a lot like Liam Neeson. I'm... But I'm pretty sure it's not. That's it. Of last words. At least now he can be at peace. And better yet, my old Padawan, he'll never learn about his secret children. Oh boy. I was kind of thinking we are going to see. I was hiding in your ship this whole time. What the? And I'm your real dad. What the? And we are still here too. Oh, Master. <laughs> Hello there. <laughs> Of course. Well, thanks, Anakin. Thanks for all of it. We are oh my gosh. She didn't die. That was pretty good, yeah. Obi Wan Kenobi. Now that's a name I am. Ah ha ha. Actually, of course, he did the voice. Which was not that long ago. By the way, Luke, this is your... You know, he previously... Uh, I remember... I remember he... He did the voice of... Okay, it's done. I remember when he did the voice of uh, Genie for the How Aladdin Should Have Ended video. Because he, cause he can do a pretty good Robin Williams impression. And he can also do a pretty good Obi-Wan impression, too. But anyways... Oh, that was... That was pretty good. That was that was pretty funny. All right. 
Enough said. Jump cut to my thoughts now. Hey, guys. So that was my reaction to how Star Wars Obi-Wan Kenobi should have ended. And again, that was pretty good. Not bad. Um... And, th th yeah, there there were some characters that didn't make it in this video, but, you know, it's okay. I mean, this still turned out pretty good. Um, and especially, like, with its funny moments, like, the whole conversation between Obi-Wan, Anakin slash Darth Vader, and Qui-Gon Jinn, like, hilarious. And not to mention the subject brought up of uh, Force healing and, you know, why Qui-Gon didn't recover from that and Phantom Menace, you know, as they talked about. And... You know, for me, it's like, well, nobody else was there, and Obi-Wan, he was hanging on, just, you know, as we all remember in, in The Phantom Menace, um, and there was just no time to do so, um, and, <laughs> like, Qui-Gon seeing Obi-Wan, like, he had always been there, that, that's just, that's hilarious, but, um, especially because, you know, Obi-Wan, like, getting killed as well, and uh, Leia, she survived, and she's floating out in space, doing the same pose as she would in The Last Jedi. They went there, just, <laughs> and especially the Inquisitor saying, hello there. <laughs> oh, man. But, uh, anyways, but overall, this, again, this was pretty funny. I really enjoyed this, and what about you guys? What did you think of this, and what did you think of my reaction? Leave comments, and give this reaction a like as always. So, with all that being said, thank you very much for watching. I hope you guys enjoyed my reaction to how Star Wars Obi-Wan Kenobi should have ended. I look forward to what, uh, what, what the next uh, Hizzy video is going to be, you know? Uh, more reactions on your way. They're gonna be awesome. Keep looking forward, and I'll see you guys in the next video slash reaction. Take care, and peace out.